Welcome to the Daily Mirror News Roundup. You're with me, Thaliba Kader. Let's take a look at the headlines first. Health workers on strike. CPC fuel prices revised. Heavy rain this evening. King Coconut exports up by 117% in 2023. Population and housing census begins. Pirit Mandapa made out of discarded lottery tickets. Health service unions initiated a symbolic strike in hospitals throughout the island this morning. The strike commenced at 6.30 a.m. and concluded at 12 p.m. Following the strike, protests and demonstrations were organized in front of hospitals across the entire country. This coordinated action was in response to a list of 10 demands from the health service unions. The Ceylon Petroleum Corporation has adjusted fuel prices effective of last night. Notably, Lanka Petrol 92 octane decreases by 9 rupees to 356 rupees per litre. While Lanka Petrol 95 octane Euro 4 rises by 3 rupees to 423 rupees. Additionally, Lanka Auto Diesel increases by 5 rupees to 356 rupees per litre. Lanka Super Diesel 4 Star Euro 4 goes by 10 rupees to 431 rupees. And Lanka Kerosene increases by 7 rupees to 249 rupees 2 litre. The Department of Meteorology forecasts rainfall or thunder showers in numerous areas of the island expected to occur after 2 p.m. In 2023, Sri Lankan King Coconut exports surged by 117% due to rising international demand, generating 140 million rupees in revenue. The Agriculture Ministry discussed future coconut cultivation strategies, emphasizing the need for soil testing, identifying suitable areas and introducing new, more appealing king coconut varieties. The Coconut Development Authority is tasked with developing a model village for king coconut cultivation. The population and housing census, held once every decade, commenced today at the Presidential Secretariat Office. A distinctive aspect of this year's census is the integration of tablet computers alongside traditional printed documents for data collection as highlighted by the President's office. A captivating Pirit Mandapam was skillfully crafted out of discarded lottery tickets in the town of Hikadua. This was the Daily Mirror News Roundup. You were with me, Thaliba Kader. For more information, visit our website www.dailymirror.lk.